Hello and welcome to another update video about Fetch AI. So we're all waiting for a clear signal that a low has been made here. The possibility certainly exists and we get the first early signals that a trend reversal might occur, but it is very, very early days and could without a problem still make one more low. Um, the levels are still relevant that I highlighted before. So looking at the bigger picture here, this yellow support area is still very relevant for the larger degree bullish scenario where we rallied in a wave one coming down in wave two in a W, X, Y structure and the wave W consists of an A, B, C. The wave X consists of an A, B, C. We can discuss and debate if the wave X should sit here or here. It doesn't make so much of a difference really because both are possible. Um, maybe I'd rather like it here actually, but again, it doesn't make a great difference. And then we have here oh, an A, B, C wave to the downside. And in the C wave, we had a wave one, we had a wave two, we had a wave three, a wave four, and a wave five. So it's one of the coins like Solana where we could hit, where we could count the overall correction complete, and it actually hit the lower support or trend line of this descending trend channel. Now we just need to see if price can push higher because if it's turning around, this is certainly a good point or time. And important is for that bigger picture bullish scenario that it does not break below the 78.6 retracement and again that's at 17.5 cents now is a move up possible everything is possible so possible definitely is it probable well i think it's probable because we have the correction complete right the thing is just can we confirm it yet and i can't really confirm it yet but i think the chances are certainly quite good the odds are, are good because we have a wave one to the upside, which however I would count as a leading diagonal, then an A wave, an overshooting B wave and the C wave um, did hold support, did actually hold quite well, and it could now be in a third wave, but then it would literally need to rally now. Bear in mind that these micro counts, they're always less reliable, okay? But the point is, on in the very short term here, zoomed in to make this one to set up valid and likely and result in a third wave, it needs to hold the 23.2 cent level. Now it didn't even reach that area. It reacted, I think, to the 38.2 FIB level, which would be a very shallow wave two, which Solana did as well. Not the most common target for a wave two. So at the moment we have to we have to be ready that it could come down a little bit lower again. But as long as it's holding 23.2 cents, we can assume that an overall low has been made already here on the 24th, 25th of May would even be clearer if price broke out now above the B wave high at 28.9 cents. The problem is I don't have this as a very clear impulse and the move down wasn't really deep enough. So again, I'm still a bit skeptical if this is already the breakout, but you know, you naturally are skeptical in trend reversal areas because this would be now an active trend reversal and it's just trying to, to get it done. Some coins are doing it. Some coins are more successful at the moment than others. Very difficult at the moment out there. Very difficult. This could still be the way forward. So if, if this is not correct, okay, and if we haven't bottomed yet, then it would form here a way four and make another low in a way five. We need to just relabel that differently. Both scenarios are possible. And I have unfortunately not yet any clear signal that it has bottomed, but as said, against the 23.2 cent level, the focus could now be on higher. And what I eventually need to see to really, really confirm the correction is over is a break out of that corrective price channel that would have certainly bullish implications, but then price is already around 40 cents. Now, FET is a highly volatile coin, so it wouldn't take long necessarily to get there, right? So yeah, let's, um, let's focus on that and um, yeah, hope you liked the update. If you did, please hit the like button, leave a comment and subscribe. And if you really like the content, then please check out the channel membership. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye-bye.